So that's the road going into where we're heading. And as you can see, there's no tire tracks. Pretty excited for that, because I don't think there's gonna be anybody here unless they've been here for a couple days. finally got a spot here there's the main road there's like you saw earlier there's not a person anywhere i don't know if maybe there'll be somebody back in here that's been here for a couple days but no nothing got a little fire pit there and i have a front hitch for this thing that i finally got back on and then a winch it's just mounted like a tray it comes out with a pin i have one of those receiver tubes on my car trailer just take it off there put it on here because i kind of figured this you don't really want to get up in here and like slide off in a ditch have to get winched out so get on that because this is definitely i mean it's a few good inches anyway something like that anyways we're gonna get a fire going here all right fire pit is a little snowy i got a fire starter i got like the top of one of these egg cartons it's like foam or foam not foam like cardboard a lit on that hmm. I guess more lighter malfunctions it's perfect all right back to old trusty we'll see if it works no it does not work So I'm definitely putting some of these in there. I don't know if that's traditional for like a California burrito, but I really like these. But I've had trouble finding these. Like, I don't know, weeks now, month, more, I don't know. Cannot find these. Finally found a few cans of them. Okay, hear me out here. I don't know. It says you microwave them in four minutes, done. And they're crispy. No, I know, I don't have a microwave, but trying to come up with a way to do this like you put the whole thing in there right i wonder if i just can't like wrap this whole thing in foil just to keep the heat in yeah this is gonna go bad i don't know i've never tried this but let's see how it goes all right so uh according to this thing lift the back tab tear it not there. Tear it over here on the thing. And you just got like a, an assortment of fries in here. I think they're all supposed to be laying kind of flat. Push it down flat on top of the fries. Then you microwave. Four minutes. Yeah, this is definitely not going to work. I'm thinking I don't want to like completely go too crazy with it. Maybe let a little steam and heat out. I don't, I don't know. I think one layer, pinch all the way around. Maybe like that. Maybe take it out every so often and kind of give it a shake just to maybe keep them from getting too done on one side. I bought two of these just in case I ruined one. Hoping that is not the case. Okay, so update. I had to abandon the foil. It's getting way too hot in there. But they're actually cooking like... I 
I mean, that's, that's cooking. Package caught on fire a touch, but don't worry about that. It's actually cooked just fine. So I'm going to add these first, I guess. Never even heard of queso quesadilla. Looks like it might be alright in a burrito. Got our steak meat. You can see that. It's nice and dark out now. Got some mild pico de gallo. Gallo, I guess how you pronounce it. Should've got a spoon because that's just going to be all the moisture. Went with the spicy guacamole this time. I've had this before, and I really didn't think it was spicy at all. I'm trying to distribute it kind of evenly. I know no, it's not going to. I'll probably use this whole little container since that's a pretty large burrito. Good enough. Definitely heated this tortilla up at one point, but it's going to be nice and cold by now. Looks like a burrito to me. All right, burrito is done. Just gonna go with the old pocket knife, cut it in half. Maybe. Huge mess. I'm gonna look too bad. I found these little like single serve tenders. There was like some other brands at Walmart for like a dollar. Never had fire roasted jalapeno kinders, but all the kinders I had are pretty good, so I thought I'd give it a shot. It's not bad. It almost has like a sweetness to it. Yeah, that's not like very spicy at all, really. I mean, it doesn't say that it's crazy hot. It just says hot sauce. That's an alright flavor. Just a lot sweeter than I thought it'd be. Shake well. I didn't do that. Ended up being a pretty large burrito. That's good. I'll try that on there. I'm make a huge mess for sure. That's too much. Way too much for one bite. Not bad on there at all. I like that. Yeah, I might have to find a bigger bottle of this. I'm sure, you can probably get it like on the internet. I would imagine. Mm -hmm. I like that. Really been craving a burrito recently. Those fries turned out so much better than I thought. You ain't gonna be able to see that, but one right there. Really not that bad at all. not all over me yeah 
I want to give that a shot though. That's not too bad. On a heat scale, it's nothing like too crazy. Like a six out of ten, heat wise. At the most. Flavor wise, it's not bad. Thought I'd have a little more of a kick, but still. I'd give it like a six to eight. Probably be in the sevens if it was just like a touch less sweet. Anyway. Can hardly half of that because I get the biggest burrito shells I can find because I ever pack them every time, no matter what. That one barely rolled. Like, if they made them like this big, I would get them. I would just have like a seven pound burrito. Anyways, I'm gonna eat that real fast. All right. So, dinner's done. The mess is definitely cleaned up. Can't, can't see me there. Here's some light. And what? I'll let the fire die down too far, so I stuck that back up. So it's cool. Cool down a little more. It's very cloudy, but it's not supposed to snow tonight. But it is supposed to get down to 13 degrees at the lowest. Right now, it's 20 degrees. Which is, it's pretty cool. So. Yeah, I'm just going to stick the fire up, warm up a little bit, and just hang out. That's all you can do, right? Yeah. Other than that, I'll see you guys in the morning. Well, good morning. So I had a little bit of a technical difficulty last night. I didn't really get to uh, do any more filming. I don't know what happened. I just wouldn't, like, something wasn't cooperating with me. I mean, you didn't miss anything. I literally just sat by the fire, got too cold, got in, went to bed, woke up. But usually I'd do something else, getting in bed, I don't know, something. Anyway, morning time now, and I got a new coffee to try. Uh, this is not the right one. I saw, like, the red, and I thought it was right. It's just a mocha. Well, that's not, yeah. I looked, I saw one that said like something holiday, peppermint, I don't know what it was, something or another. Oh, that didn't even do that. Got the wrong one. It's got plain old mocha. I'm pretty sure I've had this on the channel before. I believe. Huh. I was doing it because Christmas is soon. Like, this Monday? What's today? I don't even know. I think it's like within the next five days. Like something kind of festive. I mean, it's still kind of festive. It's got snowflakes and it's red, but... There's a whole new flavor and everything. Oh, that's sweet. Surely, I don't know. I'll have to go back and look, but surely I've had this one on the channel before, so. I don't know, maybe I'll rate this one. Go back and find the other one and see how they compare. Yeah, it's awfully sweet. I can't imagine I gave it a high score if I have had it on the channel. I don't know. I'd get like mid sixes, six six or so. Probably in the sevens if it was just a touch less sweet. But well, anyway, it's, still, it's all right. But anyway, that's that. Car for review ruined. Yeah, I've been wanting a burrito for a while. No, it wasn't anything too intense or crazy, but I kind of crave one. I hadn't had a California burrito in a while. I want to say I've seen a California burrito with shrimp in it, maybe. No, that's probably more like a surf and turf. I don't know, but that's, I thought of that last night. Shrimp would have been good in there. But definitely tasty. Pretty impressed those fries worked out. Like, I had oil on a pot, like I was going to deep fry them. And then I saw those and thought, might as well try it, right? Just about burned the cardboard completely up that was sitting in, but it worked. So if you ever think about trying that, put them over the fire nice and low. Don't get too intense and it will work. Gotta keep turning them. But they were like crispy and everything. So definitely give that a shot if you're, you know, ever wanting fries at camp. But uh, yeah, definitely pumped to get some snow camping in because uh, last year I wanted to, and I think it only snowed here like twice and I didn't get to go at the time. So definitely excited for this trip. 
Definitely got pretty cold last night. It was supposed to get down to 13. I'm sure it probably did. It was chilly. But I do love me some snow camping. Um, I didn't get as cold as I thought I would, even outside. Like, all I had was t-shirt, hoodie, no toboggan, no gloves. My pants are lined. And then I had a thick pair of socks on, which is still toe boots. My toes got a little cold eventually because of that. But, yeah. So next time, I'll come a little more prepared. But we get much more snow sometimes we don't the next five days is supposed to be in the 50s so but anyway stick around for some more snow camping hopefully and uh yeah thanks for tagging along for now thanks for watching